we we took it was Jens, myself, and one of the folks that came with us when we joined Google from our from our math team, Stephen La. The three of us went into a room in Sydney and started in earnest on prototyping. And, so, and then we, a little bit later, we we had. Um, we had two of our colleagues from the MAPS team join us. So by the time we had a full working prototype, and this took us about eight or nine months, we were only five people on the wow. team. So we took it from that one line, plus Jens's idea that we didn't really make a point of telling Sergey and so on. Um, we took it from there to a prototype with five guys in yeah. a room in Sydney. Then we came out and we showed this prototype, which was very much designed exactly to do a demo, trying to trying to show off this vision. And it was actually the, the script that you saw this morning is actually adapted from the script we did back then. This is in late 2007, and so it was based on that, based on the prototype that we we asked Larry and Sergey, "Hey, can we go to Sydney and pitch the engineers there and join us?" And and we did, and we I think we grew the team to 20 overnight. Um, and then, so, and this was in late 2007, and then between then and now, we slowly grow the team uh, in, in large part by encouraging people that we knew and loved from the MAPS team, like Steph, for example, worked with us on the MAPS team to, to come join us when it was appropriate. We built the prototype and laid out the vision. And then we took it from 20 people to 50 people over a year and a half when we turned the prototype into product or rather mm -hmm. preview of our product <laughs> we're still working on the product it's a it's a complicated thing to argue that I'll tell you 20% is not a day a week 20% typically engineers save that up yeah when they hit a deadline on the main project then they do a week or two of 20% time which works a lot better now you're not supposed to be saving up right it's not vacation time more than no no that's not what I mean but you shouldn't you know you're not supposed to just save up arbitrary amounts of 20% time but in all the time Jens and I worked on maps we'd never done 20% work mm. and so in theory we had actually saved up eight months worth of 20% time and so it wasn't actually how we phrased it but you could say we went to ask permission to actually do yeah. Eight months worth of 20% time, but full time. Yeah. So we we this I have worked on nothing else since we started this in in, in very early 2007. There was just a 50 of us, and we and it was very buggy in the beginning, and but we little by little um, got to really like it. And the story that Steph told about how on the team, even after a year and a half of working hard on it, talking about it every day, when we start started using it finally. It still took us a while to figure out use, how to use it, mm. how to become more mm. productive using it. Right? And in the beginning, many of the things we did were really just us using the tool as if it was email. And then we realized, yeah, wait, with these editing features, we can do this thing. And then we realized all of a sudden how things become more efficient. Um, and, and so there's a whole set of kind of standard ways that we're using ways that we've discovered as we go and we're still discovering on the team. Mm. It makes it so much more efficient to keep track of things, to produce documents, to...